<laughs> I'm back. <laughs> oh, let me let Annie jump on. I was gonna just face call her, but. <sighs> Y'all. Hey, Miss Lisa. It's amazing how one post, one person, one comment can change your day. If you missed it, uh, <laughs> which it just posted, but um, Annie tagged me in a post that seriously just like it spoke to my heart um I look a mess I looked a mess on this last Facebook live where I was cleaning my brushes but y'all my team I just need to <sighs> where's Annie at can somebody tag Annie Miss Janet can you tag Annie I think I tagged Annie I don't know Sometimes this team to me is so much more than, than the makeup and the skincare. <laughs> I started all this in December not knowing um, <laughs> what was gonna happen with it in my last in the last team I couldn't I couldn't recruit. I wasn't special. <laughs> look at me right now. I'm a bum. <laughs> I don't look too special. But this team is at almost 120 people. And they mean so much to me. I've just, God has blown my mind with the people that he's gifted me with. <laughs> Christina, you know I'm emotional. <laughs> Um, Annie just tagged me in something super <laughs> sweet and it's just like sometimes when you've had a rough week, a little, a little comment can make a big difference. Uh, love you too, Greg. Um, this last three months has made a huge difference. Hey, Annie. <laughs> you made me cry, so I got back on here. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> um, <laughs> I was just saying how thankful I am and how a little comment, y'all, I can't see without my glasses, but I'm gonna have to wipe my face. <laughs> how a little comment can make a big difference when you feel like I feel like I have slowed work in my business I feel like I have slacked on our team because it's turned into working two full-time jobs until my regular full-time job ends on Tuesday um oh sorry about that I absolutely love you I love you, Miss Annie, and I love this team. Um, sometimes you just feel like you're doing really crappy. Even though you're working your butt off, you're like, you know, my team feels like I'm probably failing them because I stay swamped. I literally, <laughs> I'm working my regular job right now. Until it ends on Tuesday, I work that from 8 to 4 during the week and then 7 to 3 on Saturdays. And then from that time on, I am trying to catch the team's lives. I'm trying to answer questions and I feel like I'm not present on my Facebook the way that, um, that I had been before um, all this started going on. I have not felt that way, well, not once by you. 
thank you. <laughs> that means a lot. <laughs> uh, you're amazing one day. I hope I can be successful. Very good at what you do. Thank you so much. <sighs> I just wanted to say, um, direct sales is not what everybody sees and thinks of it. Um, you know, some teams, I, they haven't felt like a family, but this one does. <laughs> and taking your mom to her appointments, too. Yeah. <laughs> I don't talk about that a whole lot, because that's your story to tell and not my mama, but we go through a lot there, too. <laughs> um, but this... This team and the, these women in my life, Christina, Annie, Danielle, like, oh my gosh, we have 120 people. If I could sit here and name off every single one of y'all, I would do it. Times are tough right now. The economy is tough. But these girls get on here and they work their business and they support their communities like, Annie just did, like, this is her heart, y'all. She just got on and did a $50 giveaway for just sharing a video for somebody to use to pay a bill to feed their family. This company is blessing us. And so that we get the opportunity to bless other people, too. Um... Women I've never met that feel like sisters. Yeah. <laughs> Christina, I was so looking forward to meeting you in Florida. I hope that still gets to happen in June. To the point where if that and my real estate class actually both get to happen and happen at the same time, I was thinking about pushing that back to August because I wouldn't trade meeting y'all for anything. Like, that. this is my family. Um, and I never thought that starting this, that I would be able to get on here and feel comfortable looking like this, to cry and tell y'all what my team means to me. Like, I started this and I dreaded Facebook Live. You can't dread Facebook Live when you build a team of 120 people. <laughs> you gotta get up and, and do something. Uh, I had a conversation the other day about you at work. I said I had full confidence in you after Fiserv. You're doing amazing things and have a solid drive and support system. You're going to do so well. Keep following your dreams and stay humble. God's blessing you for your work. <laughs> Thank you, Brent. I'm gonna miss y'all. Y'all are like my family too, like y'all. The people that you work with, whether or not you see them every day, they turn into your family. Especially if they're good people. <laughs> and I've worked with so many good people um, at Serve, and I'm working with so many good people now. Like, leaving Serve, I couldn't have found a better family to enter. If that didn't happen, we will make our own extravaganza. Christina, I am so down for that. <laughs> I'm gonna come watch Bert do his yard work. <laughs> that cracked me up. I needed that so bad. Like, I've had so much stuff that I, like, people are like, Facebook is the devil. You don't need to be on Facebook all the time. Y'all, I work from Facebook, first of all. I'm gonna be on here. Second of all, you can find stuff, if you look for the joy in things, if you look for people posting positive stuff, you will find it. Hey, Vincent, you want to say hey to everybody? Come here, come here. Oh, uh, come here. Oh, it's my assistant. Oh, okay. Love you, Auntie. I don't know why you're crying, but I love you because I'm oh, so sweet. I love y'all. Just keep being you, your soul, it's beautiful. I have ups and downs, you got this. Thank you so much. God is good. Thank y'all. 
I hate live, but gotta do them. Casey, I felt that way at first too, and now this is my comfort zone. Like y'all, I'm sitting here with no makeup on. My hair looks like I haven't washed it in a week, even though I washed it yesterday. I just didn't dry it, and Root Lifter doesn't do the best if you don't dry your hair. <laughs> uh, you know I'm not going anywhere. We're still family. Yes, and I still think that once all this flies over, we're all gonna have our farewell lunch that we were planning. Anyways, a director's getaway. That sounds nice. Hello, dog. Y'all, what a week. <laughs> if anybody else has had a week, you know, send me a message. I'm, I'm praying for y'all. We all need it. This is nuts. This team is blessing me beyond measure. I read Andy's post and I just broke down in tears and I told Matt I was coming back in here to get on Facebook Live again after I just got off of it. <laughs> Um, Christina knows me and my emotions that go one to a hundred real quick. Um, but y'all, we're blessed. <laughs> and when I tell people that are like, oh my gosh, I couldn't recruit my past company. Like this, this, this escalated quickly <laughs> and I don't like, I'm not saying that that's like an automatic given for everybody but if you get on and you work and you put your effort into it God's gonna bring you your people and it doesn't have to be a huge number of people to make a difference when I started this my first weekend Christina had already made a difference in my life Annie made a difference in my life before I started this because she accepted me into her team in my old company when I felt like I didn't have anybody to talk to. Direct sales stigma needs to die. Like, it straight up just needs to go somewhere. And I know I'm rambling about 20 million different things, y'all, but I'm just, I'm letting it all out. Direct sales is not a pyramid scheme. Guess what? If you have a boss at work and they make more money than you and they have a boss at work and they're making more money than them, guess what? What's that sound like? Y'all part of a pyramid scheme. <laughs> but I just hate it when people talk about it like that because this is my family. This is not us pushing products this is us talking and selling stuff that we believe in. Um, I know I, for dang sure, was ready to try every single product. Christina can verify that before I jumped into this opportunity. I miss you too, Brigitte. 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 I probably needed her earlier when I was crying. I got big Brigitte back here too. But y'all, direct sales is silly to some people. People talk all kinds of crap, but this has changed my life. If you had told me three or four months ago that pharmacy was going to be it for me, that I was going to have a team of almost 120 people, if we were going to be doing almost $20,000 in sales a month, I would have told you that you were nuts, but that's my own fault because I should believe that God can do anything for me if I put my mind to it and I put my work to it. Hey, Julianne. Changing lives. Bottom line is you don't know what it is until you're here. Once you're, you are, your mind is blown away. So $19.99 changed my life. I won't say it found me Annie because Annie was already there, but it did, it did get me a giant sisterhood full of the most loving people that I've ever experienced in my entire life. I could message any single one of them at any point in the day or the night and ask them to pray for me or tell them I needed somebody to talk to. And that would be the quickest group of people to be like, girl, I am here 
for you. Blown away. I just wanted y'all to know Andy's post made me cry and I am thankful for her and I love her and I love this entire team and I am blessed beyond measure and as of Tuesday this is my job y'all like this is this is this is my career I get to spend my career helping people find solutions for their problems I get to help women feel more beautiful, empower them, help them to make their living from home if they so choose or extra money for bills or, you know, like self-care money. That's fine too. That's okay. You don't have to have mind-blowing goals, but you can. I say find a reasonable number goal and then find a goal that just absolutely blows that one out of the water. Chase them both. That's fine. I love you, mama. All right, y'all. I'm not gonna blow up your news feed all night, but I just felt like I needed to address that and tell y'all how thankful I am for these women. Um, and if you have somebody that's important to you, say something. Tell them every now and then. Sometimes that just might need to be exactly what they needed to hear. What Annie just posted. <laughs> Um, apparently was exactly what I needed to hear because it just um, really touched my heart and I'm so thankful that I've found these wonderful friends. I want to come see your remodel makeup room and it's almost pool time. Let's have a girl day. Love you pretty lady. You're rocking it. Hugs. Thank you so much Casey. You're welcome here anytime girl. When the pool opens we gonna be out by the pool. All this is gonna blow over. We're gonna be just fine. And we're going to enjoy some time together. Thank you so much, Miss Julianne. Thank you, Miss Dan. I'm so glad I met you, too. I'm super thankful for you and your sweet mama. All right, y'all. I'm going to wish y'all a good night once again. And I kind of sort of promise that I won't be back on here tonight. <laughs> I love y'all. Seriously, thank you so much for your support. Whether it's liking my posts, sharing my posts. If you're a customer, that's great. If you are on this team, y'all, every single person means the world to me and I cannot express my gratitude for all these people that I get to meet and talk to. Oh, all right, I love y'all. Have a great evening. Happy almost Sunday. Bye.